Hi guys, welcome to Tropit Studio. Before we get started with the tutorial, you need to download a free Chrome extension called Tropit Studio. You can go directly to the Chrome store and search for the name or click the link on the homepage. Now just click on add extension and we are done here. Okay, so now we are going to amazon.com. We go to the bestseller list. We pick a random department. We go down to a sub department and we choose this product right here. Now you can see the Tropit Studio icon on top of the image. We click it and first we have to log in. And then it starts gathering the information. And we can see it found a match on eBay. Somebody is selling this exact product for $78 and he buys it on Amazon for $55. A little bit more than $20 profit. The other information you can see here is CA the ASIN. You can see the rating, bestseller ranking on the eBay tab. You can see the eBay price, the seller name, feedback score and the location. When you click on the name of the seller, you get a new tab with the eBay shop of the seller. We can look at his other items he is selling right now. And the Tropic Studio iframe will pop up. But first we want to narrow it down to only sold products. And we run the Amazon Fast Scan. The tool will get us the information from Amazon. It tells us the price, if it's a prime item the rating and how many units this eBay seller sold. For example, this one, he sold it for $16.18. Then this next one here, he bought it on Amazon for $17.85 and sold it for $32. Let's take a closer look at the item. You can see the price here. He sold two, no, he sold one just a few days ago for so 34 dollars and he bought it for 70.85. That's a nice margin. Let's take a look at another product he is selling. He's selling this thing for $67.93 and the price on Amazon is $49.95. Let's take a closer look. He sold 12 items in the past. Recently he sold two.
67.93 each. And he gets it for 49.96. Let's open it on Amazon. Okay, let's make sure it's the same item because the image is a little bit different. It's not the same guy. Let's look at the different image. Let's see what's all included in the package. Let's see. Yeah, it looks looks like it's the same product okay let's go to another item so this one for 55 45 dollars 45 cents and he can buy it on amazon for 39 Let's see if it's the same product. The title is pretty much the same. Well, let's take a closer look. He sold 30 units. Okay, let's open it on Amazon and on eBay. And we inspect it further. Okay, this is what is included in the box when you buy it. Let's look on on eBay. And it's the same thing. Same image. Yes. So it's the same product. And he sold recently he sold two. $55 each and he gets them um, on Amazon for $39.99. Okay. Let's go. To the next items and see what he's got. So he gets the same product for 59 and he sells it for 89. Sold one. He sold three. Let's take a closer look at this item here. <clears throat> Price on Amazon is $99 and he sold it on eBay for $128. Sold one in April and then January. OK, 
here we don't, we couldn't match it with the Amazon Fast Scanner, but we still have the possibility to take a closer look. We sold it for 127 on eBay. Sold two units. So we click on the Drop It Studio icon on the image again. And here we get a recapture. We prove that we are not a robot. And we continue. And we find it on Amazon. Let's take a closer look. We open it by clicking on the Amazon icon. We sold it for 127. So, so two units in April. And on Amazon, it's 89.99. So exact same title. Yes, it's, it's a match. I will show you now another feature of Dropit Studio. You can copy the product URL and go to Dropit Studio and click on App. You paste the URL in the search bar and press go. It will present you the information right next to each other. You can click the eBay icon to open it on eBay or the Amazon icon to open it on Amazon. Shows you all the images. You can download them. Here's some more information about the price, ratings, how many items have been sold, seller information, location of the item, how many feedback the seller got. When you click here, you can see his other sold items. Here you have a closer look to the product details. You can find underneath the product description and product metadata which you can use for keywords or building your title or building your description. Let's take another look at this product. Copy the URL, paste it to drop it studio, press go. And you have the information from eBay and Amazon right next to each other. Then you can click on the icons and it will open a new tab. 
with the product from Amazon or eBay. You can see in the prices, how many have been sold, item location, Maybe you have some keywords you can use to describe the item or build the title. Product details, reason, again, additional information, eBay product details, product description from Amazon. And right next on, on the right side, the eBay product description, yes, so you can com compare them or extract information for your own description. The more product metadata, always good for finding new keywords to describe your product you're selling. Okay, so this is it for this tutorial. You can watch my other videos if you want to see how to use it for other marketplaces. To not miss my latest videos, please subscribe to my channel. If you like the content, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section. See you the next time.